welcome to the New Merrick Workshop. This segment of the WBPL 76 is brought to you by the Night Owl Association, along with the Bear Diggs Company and viewers like you. Why are you here? We derp. Ooh, woo. <laughs> Why are you here? I have to enlarge bigness. The power of chat compels you. That was a professional sheep wrangling. Hey, how the hell do you sell Truckasaurus at OnStars? Grumble about things. I'm going to do something stupid because I want to know if it works. What the fuck is my meat jiggler? I would so download feed. Diggs just got banana bow. <laughs> Very important announcement for you. Free Corn Thursday. Please don't do that anymore. Boat. You dare not defy their will. I guess the car fucks the boat. Wait, Saints Row Cooney? I love that game. Tactical Booty George. Corn Thursday. <laughs>Beautiful, beautiful. Good evening, everybody. We'd beautiful. like to welcome you all here to the New Merrick Workshop. And I am going to mute Twitch. And Cookie has 95 heart points. Don't ask questions. <laughs> this is very normal. Do not worry. It is not related to crime. We asked. <laughs> And Cookie told us it wasn't crime. Yeah. Well, I don't know if Cookie used those exact words. So I guess there is room for interpretation. There is room for crime. <laughs> There's always room for crime. It's like Jello. Hi, everybody. Oh, man, it, I'm Parallax you rob at the a bank Black with Man's Jello? Yeah. No, sh shut the hell up. Can you rob a bank with Jello? Yeah. I need to know this. It's important. Why not? Okay. Yeah, cool. it happened in 1971 in Ohio. But you're telling me in 1971 there was an Ohio Jello robbery of a bank. Yeah. Yeah, it was in the newspapers. You didn't read about it? They called him the Jiggler. I don't read Ohio newspapers. I <laughs> see that's your loss. Uh, that's fair. It's the Ohio anyway, of the proceed. North. It's, it's the, it's oh, the Florida Ohio of the North. Ohio is the Ohio of the North. <laughs> it's the Florida No, of no. The North. Ohio is the Ohio of the <laughs> North. Ohio is that. Ohio of the North. There we go, folks. It's the Ohio of the North. Uh, hi, I'm Parallax. 
Who else is here? I'm Cookie. A cookie Hello. would download feet. I am. I would. Oh, but don't don't download feet. This is Squick telling you not to download feet. <laughs> and this is Mad Ducks telling you download whatever you want. Even well, if... okay, that's fair. well. Yes or no? <laughs> well, yes, but okay. Also do no. not download Jello. <laughs> not yet. Do not download Jello if it is for crime. Do not download Jello crime. Are we not? Are no, we not you can a... download Jello crime, but you can't download Jello for crime. Hmm. Slight difference there. Ah, it's me watching me watching me watching me. Wow, that's a big skill there. Meanwhile, in the tunnel of the that internet, one. that one. That's the one we're supposed to be on. Biz Monkey sent me a king crab. Hell actually, yeah! Actually, Biz is Monkey's... it a what spider? It looks looks like it's decorated like Spider Man, except with that blue. It's it's uh, it's Spider Man, it... King Spider Crab Man. Yeah, just we redo the '90s Spider Man series. But instead of being like, haha, I am cartoon superhero man, it's haha, I am hundred tons of two fisted murder kill. Oh, so it's Japanese Spider Man. Uh okay, yeah, that, that tracks. <laughs> um, he also sent some more pictures of that uh damn Highlander he sent in last week just to taunt me with the freehand on it because fuck him. <laughs> <laughs> And he told me in the email that's why he was sending it, so, uh, fuck him. <laughs> Look at that! Look at that! Wow. <laughs> wow. That is a powerful flex. That, mm. Look at the little penmanship. And he does it with a brush. It's not, I thought it was marker pen when I saw it. It's a brush. Fuck him. Sarvak's <laughs> wife made a bridge, and it's cool. Zarvak, yeah. what was the method of construction on this? Because my first thought was uh, EVA foam, but uh, or XPS oh, I, foam. I was thinking, but I think this is printed. It looks like they broke up other larger bridges into smaller pieces to make a small bridge out of pieces of larger bridge. Printed. No, I'm printed. I'm calling it right now peasant labor. Peasant labor, printed. got it. Peasant labor. Printed. So it's printed. Uh, hey, squick, squick's in mind. They ignored Sarvak's serious answer of printed. It's made of other bridges. <laughs> but his wife water painted it wonderfully. Game. Yeah. <laughs> it looks like a real... Looks like it could fit out. The excellent paint bridge. job of this bridge has upset my organs. <clears throat> no, I think that might have been your uh, your late lunch. I'd also possible, but the lunch also appreciated the bridge. I'm drinking liquids now in accordance with the demands of chat. <laughs> Uh, Zarvek also sent us in a uh, Commander Cody, which he has then subsequently requested we not look too closely at, so everyone get real close to your monitors. I think it's a pretty good Commander Cody. Looks like he's been uh, through the ringer on Geonosis for a bit. Like he does. Like he does. You see, here he is running Seems away reasonable. now. See? He's running toward it. He's running away from it. <laughs> <laughs> uh, what else do we have oh that's right Grimos you sent us in a couple of things Grimos I don't know how you keep managing to do this but every time you email me something it doesn't have a file extension so it comes to me and uh, and Gmail is like I don't know what this is we will now put it in the spam folder because it might be devil <laughs> robovirus but eventually, I, I do download it over much protestations and type .jpg at the end of it, and then it's happy. Yeah, chat would like you to zoom in, because 23% is not enough robot. Ooh, robot! Oh, God. Enhance bigness. <laughs> <laughs> wait, wait. Enhance. Enhance. Double click loudly and say enhance. Enhance. Wait, no. Enhance. Enhance. <laughs> that looks like a heavy gear this. franchise to me. I could see it. 
Heavy Gear, isn't that that other uh, mecha series that Eldonius is working on? I didn't know he was working on it. Now I'm, I'm very interested because Heavy Gear is a very good franchise. Ooh. Yes, I, I, think they have a Kickstarter, I think they have a Kickstarter up right now, don't they? John, do not give him ideas. Would you like to know more? Desire to know more. Would you like spies. to know more? Dot Jeff. <laughs> Owl says, in hands. Instead in of hands. In <laughs> pants. And this is Safety Factor 7. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone say hi, Safety Factor 7. We know that you're a real thing, but it's a lot funnier if we pretend you're not. Casual oh. explosion on the go. Both delivering and receiving. Dr. Christmas would like you to know that this tank has a safety factor of seven. Which, if you did not know, is somewhere between one and eight billion. Yes. Yes, it is. Tank, I, I believe you mean um, new series of aircraft, sir. If, uh, this is the finest aircraft ever developed. That's true. It flaps its wings like a bird. As one does. <laughs> In true bird flight. <laughs> true bird flight because you know we've only just started with this flying thing and birds have they've been doing this for a while so they have to know how to do this right download more bird more bird more bird i mean they're not real so you can download dr as christmas as you want. would like to know your location says mace <laughs> oh dear <laughs> it's okay if dr christmas tried to fly to your location you would be very safe <laughs> yes you would <laughs> Safety factor seven. Yeah, he... oh, God. Okay, so so here's my plan for the night. Um, I had a few things I did this week, and then I didn't really take pictures of them. So let's let's see if I can uh to pull up the thing to do the focus. Turn off the autofocus. No, no, that's oh look, the autofocus is on, and it's actually fo eh, well, it did it for a second. Autofocus <laughs> off. You don't like that. Ha ha! There it is. There it is. I made a Zuez. I made like an arc. Yes, I made the Zuez Canal. Zuez Canal. It's it's uh it is an Arcturan Guard Zeus because by God, if you're gonna make a Zeus, it ought to be as flamboyant as possible. It have tigers. It uh, does have tigers. Uh, yeah. If that thing isn't on the field blasting Eye of the Tiger with a volume controlled by its heat gauge, <laughs> I'm going to be disappointed. Okay, this was another one I did this week. It's it's a Free Worlds one of... Don't ask me. I don't remember which Free Worlds unit it is. It's, it's one of the Duchies. It's like the regulans or one it's, it's it's something like that i don't remember which one it is but it's green it's got green and blue on white so there you go that's what it is sure although i'm pretty happy with the way the white turned out on it uh okay one more thing and i'll, I'll actually show up what i'm planning on working on tonight um you guys saw this uh, at put... some point what what oh if you put those two mechs next to each other then um yeah, just hold them up right next to each other there. Uh huh. Okay. Now tell me that does not look like A, a book cover, or B, what you see in the background with like a dude in a chair in a classy vest for some kind of uh, musical experimentation album. <laughs> I actually like that, Zeus. Well, it's Arcturne, Zeus. Like, they've it's got that good. vibe going. And I, I like Arcturne and Zeus. I'll be right back. Oh, he's gone. He's gone. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I showed you guys that Eris last week and my dramatically oversized Eris that I made. I think I showed it to you. I th showed the print to you. If I didn't show the print to you, there was a print of it. I have subsequently resized it so that it's uh, less dramatically silly. And uh, I, I think I'm pretty close. I think I'm pretty close. Although the light is washing out. <laughs> the white on this so uh okay, one on the right what here if make bigger? what if make then silly the one on the left over here is uh the one that i designed in blender and actually printed so i'm, I'm very happy with this 
Oh, here's here's the bigger it, one. Here's the bigger one. Yeah, he was he was silly big, and he was wide like Kylo Ren. Mm. Okay. It okay. has like the best hits of the front of a late eighties car. If Mad Ducks were back on the microphone, then he could tell you what his immediate reaction to it was. Because he immediately accused it of being a Trans Am. And I could see it. Silence fell injuring 59, says Night Owl. Oh dear. Oh, grumble. Grumble. Okay, uh, I want to show hmm. off a couple other things I got here real quick, because... Um, well, we saw the free corn last week, right? We saw our good friend over here, the free corn on the, uh, on the, yes, the leader of Cornulon seven. That's true. That's true. He is the, uh, the ruler of Cornulon seven. I got some more stickers in because I actually ordered myself some stickers and some of them are worth looking at. Some of them are uh, pretty amazing. This, uh, I like this urban Mac. It says, uh, I'm sure you all can read it. The I Am Violence Urban Mech. Yeah. Nice. Um, we've got uh, Comstar. we got a good Comstar one. Uh, pay your bills, get folked. We've got... Uh, okay, okay. We, we've got uh, just an Orion from the side here. I liked it well enough. But then, even more importantly, we got uh, the Tarian Concordat here with uh, Hippity Hoppity Get Off My Property. Love that. Then we got... Uh, I'm saving the two... Oh, wow. Arachnish. Arachnish, that is deplorable. Well I done. love it. I love it. Ruler of Cornulon 7 by Pop Euler Vote. Um, then we I got... We got a House Merrick emblem here. It uh, reads, Sorry, can't fight you today. Too busy fighting ourselves. Accurate. Uh, and then we got uh, two here that are king crabs because my son's favorite mech is the king crab. So you get uh, time for crab. <laughs> <laughs> if you would Where like would to be? find these, awesome. you can get them on Redbubble and just search for Battletech. These things will be in the first couple of pages. Along with more, I've I've got uh, an Orion sticker on the front of my uh, computer case. I can't really show you right now, but uh, what was I going to put on here? Oh, I was going to put this one on my cutting mat tonight because uh, it's great and uh, it belongs there. Top notch, ideal. There we go. My cutting mat in violence. Okay, and then I got one more thing. I got one more thing. Oh, laughing Man, you're going to have to go back and listen to the, the new cut of the intro music here after we're done. Okay, guys, guys. I found salvage boxes at uh, Barnes & Noble, so I bought some, and I'm going to open a blind box. Who's excited for an unboxing? <gasps> Woo. I'm we real so streamers on now. And Ooh. on board. We're, we're real streamers now. Well, not until we spend 40 minutes speculating on what might be inside and, yeah. like, Well, if you look at the back on the of it, there's a gargoyle on the box, so there could be a gargoyle in the box. Could be a wolfhound. Could be a wolfhound. <laughs> I don't know. Could I it no be a wolfhound? I'm not sure. I don't know. Probably uh, not. Okay. Uh, <laughs> what if it's... Is that a Pokemon? It's a it's a Pokemon. Now, to be clear, okay, this cool. one is not the Omni Mech box, so there actually could be Inner Sphere Mechs in this. Okay. So, unlike the last ones I got, this one doesn't have an Alpha Strike card in it. That's interesting. Oh, oh, what are you? Oh shit, I know what this are. What what are this? It's number eighty four. I don't remember what ah, number. Yes, number eighty four. It's Max. number eighty four. Hey, chat. What's number eighty four? <laughs> shit. Uh, probably something with laser nipples uh, is playing uh, the averages. That's a lot. That's a that's a is it? It could be. That's what Wookie said. Oh oh wait, there is a card. It's just taped to the inside of the fucking box because somebody's an asshole. And uh, he is correct. It is in fact a like a lot. I mean, not at that size. That's like Lance a little at best. Lance a bit. 
Lance a touch. Just a wee bit. Just a wee bit. It's a Lance a much. Get a touch of the old Lance. We have Lance a lot at home. It's Lance a much. General Equate brand Lance a much. Lance a yeah. some. Yeah. Great, great value. Great value, Lance. Lance <coughs> hey, so, did uh, you want me to read that my a wee oh, bit? Oh, yes. Give me just a moment. Hey, uh, okay. uh, Mad Ducks, what does that look like to you? <coughs> that looks like a Trans Am, sir. What year? Uh, 19, uh, about 1970, like old school Trans Am. There you go. I cannot be the only one that looks at that and sees Trans Am. I see. I'm thinking I might have to paint one of these black and then try to put a gold ego on it. Or Kit. Kit. Oh, no, God. Kit was something else. Uh, yeah. Or hey, Kit was a rebranded Cylon. Okay, I don't know. Fair enough. Uh, or do it black and the grill is gold. Just saying. But, uh, no, you right. can't make it a flying pimp mobile. Why not? You Why can not? absolutely make it a flying pimp mobile. Well, I can see I'm outvoted by people who are wrong. <laughs> and, and yet here we are. Being right. <laughs> Vectron oh says he can get more of a GTO out of it than a Trans Am, but he can see Trans Am. <sighs> No, no, I, Vectron is not wrong. I, I can see the GTO as well. Uh, I was just thinking, I look at it, I see first generation Trans Am. Um, but that's only because I knew somebody had had one with the, the front painted gold. So. Oh, there you go. And uh, this uh, the pilot for this thing is uh, Roberto Reynaldo. Laughing man. <laughs> mm -hmm. <laughs> Oh, for those of you on the VOD, we don't name people Lance much these days, but in the past, people were named Lance a lot. Boo. Boo. Boo this man. <laughs> I like it. Beautiful. Oh, dear. Oh. Okay, Cookie, you had a story. I have a. I have two stories. Cookie has two stories. <laughs> She's not that tall. It's going to be that kind of night, guys. Oh. It is already that kind of night. Uh, well, of course Maddux, it's that kind of night. That's why we brought up Lancelot. Mad Duck, you missed my stickers. Wait, stickers? Yeah, I had stickers. Oh, but Cookie has stories. Okay, so um, anyway, so we did the, so we did, we're working on the um, the five little ducks, you know, one little duck, um, five little ducks went out one day, you know that whole song? If you don't look it up, it's cute. Um, anyway, so there's five little ducks and they get to do all these things, right? And so we just, I decided we're going to rewrite the story or the curriculum was like, rewrite the story. And um, so I was like, well, it's going to rhyme because we're working on rhyming. We always work on rhyming. So I got two versions of it from two separate groups of children. Here's, here's uh, the first one was duck one slapped another duck. Duck two went to get a strawberry and got stuck. Duck three went to get ice cream. Duck four fell asleep in a dream. Duck five wore a ring on his ear. Mama duck said, ducklings come here. Okay. And then the second one was duck one plays with his toys. Duck two played hide and seek with the boys. Duck three jumped in the pool. Duck four skipped school. Duck five gets on the bus. Mommy duck said, come back to us. So well, that's, that was their stories. They did good stories. They did good stories. Also, the reason I have 95 heart points, as is evidenced in the title, is that um, we had an event tonight. We had another parent night, and it was uh, community partners and a STEM night. We had folks come, like the library and the park service and those state parks and the, all different things, and to tell the families, what can you do this summer? This summer? And then... Um, so I didn't have a chair, so I walked a pace the whole time, like I do. So anyway, uh, Cookie, you and C Samurai wants to know how many heart points he needs to become a magic man. I have no clue. I I have no, you know, I don't know. Maybe uh, maybe a hundred. I don't know. Uh, Pistol, um, just so you know, the Firebird was actually a trim level of the Trans Am. Uh, so the. So what? the the three cars were, uh, it was the Camaro, it, the Trans Am, and uh, what was the third one? The Camaro, the double Camaro and the turbo Camaro. 
There were three. But they of them. were all of them deceived. They were all of them Camaro deceived. Another was, Camaro was made. <laughs> <laughs> One Does Camaro bring out, like, to the rule them Geo all. Metro can I, GT. Can I redeem um, the hard points to turn the? You're gonna turn a uh, a Pontiac into a Dodge. That's that's a hell of a trick. Oh uh, crap! What was it? It was. It was. What was the fucking third one? Oh, this is gonna bother me. I mean, lots of things are gonna bother you, and we're the source of many. Well, of I mean, them. that's not wrong. <laughs> I'm gonna end up naming that Irby. So, what stickers did I miss? Okay. Uh. Well, you got you, you missed. I am violence. And, uh, mm, that's the urban mix sticker. The, th says the, out. the Thunderbird was a Ford. Um, pay your bills, get folked. Okay, I like. Um, time for crab. Always. Also, more crab because son's favorite mech is king crab. Mm -hmm. Um, House Merrick, sorry, can't fight you today. Too busy fighting ourselves. That that's that's definitely a slogan. Yep. Um. A very nice uh, three-quarter portrait of an Orion. Waiting for video. Yes, that's actually really nice. Yep. And that's then that really one. Nice. Waiting for video. Oh, okay. Yes. Yes. I'm Hippie still on. Property, get yep. off my property. I'm still on purple. There we go. Orion. Okay. Right there. Um. So, would you like uh, would you like to know what I'm painting uh, tonight? There. What are you painting tonight? I am painting a spider toaster for one of my in-laws who says that he wanted one. Nice. Uh -huh. Well, there nice. you go. When I asked him what color he wanted, I showed him three examples of different ones I've done, and he says, and I quote, "Artist's choice." Oh dear. So, artist uh, is colorblind. Oh. This is fine, because in this case, colorblind artist went and got bottled of Vallejo that says squid pink. And other bottle that says royal purple. So, so we can have royal squids? He is going to have a hot pink spider toaster. This is an in-law that makes stickers and art and vinyls and si digital signage for a living. He is going to have a hot pink spider toaster. When I sent him a picture of the pink bottle, he said he said that he will name it Mrs. Blimey. Okay, so it was just and... the two cars. It was the Camaro and the Firebird. Okay. Okay. Giddy up, GTO. Now it's stuck in my head. Giddy up, 409. Oh, wait, that's a different thing. I mean, not that different. The Camaro Bird. The uh, Thunder Cougar Falcon Camaro. Bird. Thunder Cougar Falcon Bird. Put your head on my shoulder. That sounds made up. That's good of you not to care what what other people think about your masculinity there. I care. I care plenty. I <laughs> just want to make them stop. I've got one word for you. Thunder Cougar Falcon Bird. Thunder Cougar Falcon Bird. Oh. <laughs> um, para parallax may be my equal when it comes to being able to uh, identify and continue random... <laughs> Oh no no you you got me on naming the episodes I, the quotes I can do but you have got like the and it, well, weirdly encyclopedic uh, knowledge of the actual individual episodes I don't remember the uh, names Chad, much I have no idea what they're on about Futurama we're, we're talking about Futurama we're talking about Futurama Squid. Futurama did not have the Thunder Cougar Falcon Bird yes it Futurama did absolutely absolutely God dog it okay which resurrection. Uh, Thank you for following Nisco's Tito. Oh, it was it was yes, in the first series. You. Look up, Wait, no look way. up the episode entitled "Put Your Head on My Shoulder." <laughs> Wait, is that the one where Zoidberg decides I'm a real doctor for five minutes and decides to uh, attach what? Um, oh, uh, Amy's or Amy's head to Fry's body? Nope, the other way around. But you were close. Yeah. Okay. They get, they get into a wreck. They do. They do. And then they have to clone Fry's body, I think, and it's going to take some time. Mm hmm. So they have to live together. Ah, ah. God, that show was weird. That show was amazing. 
Tiniest, tiniest of travelers. That's a cute name. I love it. Tiniest of travelers. Oh, then adorable. there's Disco Cito, and you've just been pantsed. Now you've been pantsed by Night Owl, and now, now, now tiniest. Now tiniest. Now tiniest. Now tiniest. Now been. Diggs did not turn on. Uh, I forgot to ask Diggs to turn on our custom notifications. That's okay. Um. What what do you want what am I you want me to say when uh subscription? Um Free Corn uh, Thursday? Uh, <laughs> free Corn Thursday. No, there, I, want, I want you to say you uh, can't corn free and corn your way out biscuits. of this. Corn and honey butter biscuits. God dog it. What is <laughs> this is my own fault. I know it is. Where is I'm the hyphen saying, in that sentence? Somebody write that down. Uh, Mad Ducks just accepted responsibility for something that's never happened. One thing. One thing. One thing. One thing. <laughs> one thing. Once. One. Ever. Were you the there, there the time, when Mad Ducks did the thing? Uh, the rest of the time, I simply acknowledge. I simply just just lay out the pieces and let other people enjoy the chaos. Where were like, you when Ducks admitted to something? Okay, so... Not my, not my fault. Not your fault. Nothing happened. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do tonight. This is a stalker. Who doesn't like the stalker? The stalker's pretty good. Doom blim. I mean, a lot of police. Uh-huh. And people that like privacy? Yeah, well... When you're uh, 85 tons of uh, this many missiles and lasers, it's kind of hard to take that kind of thing seriously. Sir, are you attempting to seduce me with the hottest possible assault mech? Oh, it's it gets hot, all right. <laughs> so here's the thing: I am painting this for my uh, my uh, nephew, my oldest nephew, uh, How's a Car's oldest. So kids, uh, a kids, a car, kid, kids a car one. So I am trying to figure out if he was here, I'd ask him. How um, I've seen you in the chat once or twice now. So if you want to tell me. Oh, uh, Stalkers is uh, the youngest of my nephews. Okay. Um, what um, what color do you think he'd like it? Um, also, thank you, Moonstruck Man, for joining us for the first time. We've got a lot of first timers tonight. Oh, man. Bless you all. And hearts. we're happy to have you. All we right. don't understand why you're here, but uh, strap in. It's going to get weird. Uh, I mean, so, GL colors, he says. Oh, I, I can do that. Am I supposed to say it again? Uh, I mean, you can say it as often as you want. Uh, I, I want the prompt for this one. Well bootled jorts. Corn and honey butter biscuits. <laughs> I, I, it, 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 some things I do that... Your corn biscuits are now buttered with honey. Do not question it. Do not resist. Simply accept and perhaps request a napkin. Let us know what your color, what you're painting up, Moonstruck. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Uh, so, somebody could poke Diggs in and ask him if he wouldn't mind changing that, but I also don't. I'm I'm not overly concerned. Unbearable chaos. You have the original Green Lantern stalker, strangely accurate. Oof. Oof. Hot, hot pink. Hot Spider pink toaster. Do you have I'm, that color pre-mixed? I have no idea. It says squid pink. You know what? Watch. Let me send you a picture. Squid too. pink is not that... Okay, I don't know. Squid pink is not hot pink, by the way. If I'm well, understanding. Okay, let me just... I don't know the words. I mean, I don't know. I can't he doesn't tell. know what I, color squids are. Listen, I know. I know, I know. squids are, are tasty when cooked correctly. That, that's when it. they're I breaded and fried, they are pretty picture, good. Photograph in the hauler. Okay. God, you're going to make me tab over to look at things. How dare you? Oh, yeah, see, that's, that's not hot. Gum pink. That's, a lo that's a lovely Pepto-Bismol pink. Aha, uh -huh, so it's the it's the Pepto-ster. Yep. pink to bismol I, I am willing to take oh, pepto Oh, no. <laughs> T.O., that's really... I'm not sure we needed to know that. Oh, good lord. But... What, what has T.O. done? <laughs> <laughs> his cat was wow. hard on his girlfriend. For uh, those of you watching at home, ah. uh, there was cat fart. <laughs> well, that, that's the thing about, about cats. There's no warning. 
just no. the wall of death. Well, or if they're mad at you, then they'll they'll fart at or stink up stink at you. Yeah. Yep. Yes, they will. They if you're lucky, morning. if you're lucky, they'll do that. Otherwise, they'll just pee in your shoes. Or claw the hell out of you. I see. I can deal with that. I just. I, I mean, I, jokes I, on them. They have twice it's... as many shoes than I do, and I'm willing to pee a lot longer. <laughs> oh Lord. Unless, of course, it's um, you're sleeping and it's uh, certain portions of your anatomy. So, uh, re- as a cat owner, real talk. <laughs> as, as a cat I owner, have... in this line of conversation, this is bound to get interesting. <laughs> uh, well, no, 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 no. This is this is going to be perfectly normal. This is this is cat owner talk. How many times have I heard you say this is going to be perfectly normal, and then madness dribbles <laughs> out of the corner of your mouth? I'm sorry, uh, the 14 are you gauge, The 14 yeah. gauge anti personnel spatula was a perfectly normal idea. Oh, mm. And and Haleon <laughs> has recorded it and it is art. It is lovely and I will have it ready in the next couple of days. Oh, but I have but That's I've got be like perfect three for like dealing with stuck on eggs. See? It's multi purpose. I think it's a perfectly normal idea. Anyway, as a cat owner. If a cat is going to jump on you while you are asleep, they only ever target the bladder. That is it. This is not true, because my testicles have borne witness. Ah, well, okay then. Perhaps your cat simply has poor aim. Uh, Perhaps my cat has remarkable aim. (laughs) Uh, whichever one is worse. Uh, or, both, uh, or in my case, it's it's um, upper portions of anatomy. <laughs> yeah. I contain a wide variety of organs. I was, I was expecting Squick to say something I'm like, just... I contain a large number of cats. I was, I'm just glad he did not say, I have downloaded much anatomy. <laughs> oh, I have, but that is a matter for another time. Wait, weren't you just telling audience. Cook? Weren't you just telling Cookie not to download feet? <laughs> yes, do not download the anatomy. That is for me to download. I see. Rules are for me, and download not for me. as I say, not as I do. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, great! Download as I say, not as I do. Grimos is in there, isn't he? <laughs> no, he's busy clipping. He's too. Oh, he's he's okay. busy clipping. He's oh, all right. It's, it's gonna get clipped. Which, by the way, I need more clips so that I can put more. I can have more options for uh, components for the song because that's where yeah. I'm getting all the quotes. Where I managed yeah. to get things like Cookie saying, "I would totally download more feet," <laughs> <laughs> or Squick saying, "Fuck that boat." <laughs> Look, sometimes vehicles have a little bit of a smash up. <laughs> I mean, all right. Maze Hughes decided to uh, re up Ty's. Hey, ah, awesome. Hey, well, thank you kindly. Maze, we are very glad to have you here. You, uh, you have been uh, with us and part of much madness. And I appreciate having you here, Maze. Yeah. You are one of the people I interact with consistently in the auxiliary, and I appreciate you being there. Uh, there is a lot of talent floating in the auxiliary, and I've said this so many times, people are eventually going to get tired of me saying, I won't care, I'm going to keep doing it. There's a lot of talent out there, and uh, in the auxiliary, there's just a world of talent. And uh, you guys always impress me, all yeah. the time. And y'all are so generous, too. Yep. Bro. Numeric Workshop, brought to you like viewers like y'all. And occasionally, yes. Why are you here? Why are you here? Because. <laughs> Maze is attracted to the madness. Maze likes it. Well, I mean, to be fair, you've been exposed to like some kind of uh, SCP mimetic cognito hazards on this show. Hello! So. Yep, that's one of them. Hey, wait a minute. There's the other. <laughs> Together yeah. we fight crime. Together On the we side do of what? crime. <laughs> we yes. do what now? Poorly. Okay. No, we that's fight. that's the other person I thought. Anyway, whatever. We've joined the war on crime. Together we fight, comma, crime. <laughs> <laughs> Poorly, trademark. 
Yeah, da, 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 da. So uh, the wife and I, uh, Mrs. Tux and I were playing uh, with, with some friends from Minnesota the other night. Mm-hmm. And we were playing Phasmophobia, as we've done once or twice. Once or twice, that is to Help say, me. pretty constantly. Um, I don't even know what level I am, so it, therefore, it's obviously not that much. Yeah, so. sure. Mm, mm, that's exactly how that works, isn't exactly, it? Yeah. I don't know. Um, I've played the occasional game. I, I, games, it has nuance, and it's a four-player game. We can play it with a friend from Minnesota. That's all. No more questions. Anyway, and uh, hey, boy, one, of our, one of our friends up in Minnesota pointed out that Whenever we're thinking or doing something, we both will just kind of do the little scat thing. Okay, I thought you meant like take a dump on the sidewalk. Yeah, that one too. Uh, this, thanks, scat man. Anyway, uh, he noticed, he pointed out that uh, Mrs. Ducks and I will both do it when we're concentrating. And uh, I, you know what? I thought that was pretty, pretty funny. It is. I- Oh, now no. producing human verbal screensaver to free up thinking elements from standard vocalization pattern. Night Clerk and Vectron are throwing lots of pennies at our heads, so hey. watch out. Hey! Uh, I would wear glasses. the safety hat. I huh? have a challenge for Vectron and uh, uh, throw, throw four pennies and then two pennies and then no, you can't throw zero pennies. I mean, they can. That's just not throwing pennies. Uh, well, just they can't know. throw negative pennies. And Maze well, says, Maze, "Thank you Maze very says, much." Maze watch this and throws even more pennies. Guys, you're going to oh, keep God. this up, and we're going to end up on another hype train. And Diggs is going to be confused again. You it's going to be like double there, but bad. Diggs is confused during one of our streams. I mean, it's not our fault anymore. I mean, it hasn't happened for a little bit where he's actually been confused. No, no, he's just like, oh, it's those lunatics again. <laughs> I, I, listen, I, I know that the the Black Pants Legion doesn't necessarily have. You Vectron know, Black... did it. Vectron did it. We know. <sighs> oh, God. It's close. But it we'll says. Buy. Ah, thank you very much. Um, oh, Lord. Hype train. We have a hype train. People um, all over the world now. Throw hype bits. Train. Start a hype train. Hype train. Hype train. Um, I, I know that BPL doesn't necessarily have, you know, any black sheet because we're all just, we just kind of do our things. We're weirdos together. Well, as it turns out, when you tie-dye your sheep, none of them are black. Um, we're at a hype train to hell. Well, parallax. Uh, well, they've done it. When you we're... tie-dye your sheep, the secret to successfully tie-dye your sheep is to wring them out thoroughly, and they mm. don't like that. <laughs> Ah, oh. sheep yoga. Oh, crap. Grimos just heard me say that. Wait, Bring is this where we go to a commercial sheep. of the sham wow? Da, 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 da. No, Squick, that would be sheep wow. Sheep wow. Merino wool sham wow. It's the sheep wow. No. I don't no? want a merino wool. So, um, you know what? I, I have a story. It's a very oh, short story. Is it about merino wool? Well, it's about wool. Oh, okay. Uh, this oh, is just a very short story. Well, that's that's oh, level wow, two yeah. hype train. Oh, oh, Night Owl, thank you very oh, much. Oh, good lord, thank you. We appreciate you. We don't understand you. We appreciate you. Thank you. This broadcast brought to you by the Night Owl Foundation. Why are you here? And viewers like y'all. Viewers oh, y'all. like y'all. All y'all. All the We've honey like buttered yins. so much corn. Like you and... No, no corn uh... is safe from the butterization process stolen from the finest honey processing establishments we could break into before the police were called. I have been led to understand that uh, free corn Thursday can't exist, Squick. Free Corn Thursday is a lie brought on to you by Big Corn, which believes in the power of Thursday as a marketing element. That is why they invented the 37-day calendar, which is now mandatory. Mandatory 37-day calendar and honey butter biscuits. (laughs) Hey, what would go better with pink? Pink and black, pink and gold, pink and silver. Pink and purple. Pink and black. Go complete Eddie. How Pink formal is this intended to be? How Pink and black. Um, formal. I am. Go How... Lisa Frank. Pink and black. Okay. 
<laughs> like pink and black will do a good action bit. Okay, no, pink and squick, silver. Squick, yeah, you cannot undo this now. This is a formal spider toaster. It's a formal. Sp God <laughs> Almighty! But then again, that pink is not eighties. I don't know. Whatever. Guys, 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 come on. You're, you're, you're like. And you know what I'm painting after this. Um, I have no idea. I hope it's Carol. an albatross. No, but oh. you know what it is. What is what? it? Cowboy Technodrome. Uh, excellent. Cowboy Technodrome. I don't know what that's worth, hey, but I am what? excited about it. Oh, <laughs> you can't. That's not. I don't... Squick. <laughs> what? Squick, I 3D printed a cowboy, a technodrome with a cowboy hat. Where'd that come yeah, from? Does it have like a lasso on the end of the tiny arm? Oh no, it's so much dumber than that. Uh, it has oh, no. a gigantic marshmallow on one of the giant pokey bits. And what's on, what's on, on the, the other, other one? Giant, a gigantic sausage. Hot dog. Hot I, dog. I, I, I uh, kind of love it. Dog, uh, diggity dog. Sorry, I'll stop there so we don't get. Oh God! Why would you do that to me, Cookie? <laughs> <sighs> Apparently, pink is disco formal. Pink is disco Thanks, formal. Disco formal. Okay, so um, I guess the next one is gonna have to be like a, a Canadian tuxedo uh, toaster. <laughs> <laughs> so chat our kind audience for <laughs> some re for some reason <laughs> would y'all like to see ca the uh it is primed i primed it before the show oh good would y'all like and to now see... it's ready to i mean i want to see it you want to see squid. primed cowboy toaster if you yeah. throw it on the screen for the audience to see in like a little corner that, that sounds like a stripper name hi i'm prime cowboy Someone catch my pants. I mean, Grimos, clip that. <laughs> prime cowboy. Like a prime stone cowboy. What does that mean? Yes. No more questions. I have several questions. No more questions. Not <laughs> all of them related to the cowboy stripper, only some. Like a rhinestone stripper. And if you check the holler, you will I'm, now see what you will now see to I'm share waiting. with the audience. Excellent. Yes. Good. Good. <laughs> I there, it have... there it is. Squick, would you be able to tell me how much that cowboy technodrome is worth? Well, it depends on a variety of factors. <laughs> <laughs> it's oh, man. Where did, you, where did you get something this dumb? Well, that... let's see. Parallax, who who do we know? Who could have helped me? Who could have assisted me? Rook who or Voxel. have helped myself? Frankly, with... Locust could have done it. I mean, it's kind of a long... Like, Kirsala could have done it. But they didn't. Parallax, who helped me to I, make Cowboy Spider Toaster? I couldn't begin to venture a guess. <laughs> would it happen Who would be, to be so dumb as to do that? Who gets occasionally caught up and helps me make dumb stuff? What was it, How's a Car? I bet it was How's a Car. No. The Ninja some, Turtles. Somebody's you know, you're, brother. You're not off, though. Yeah, not... because no, because no. they're oh. related to Hal's Oh, they're related to it was <laughs> I didn't know my mother was doing this kind of thing. Yes, yes. <laughs> How oh, I have concerns. Blame your mom. I see how it goes. But you know what? Must be staying. You blame uh -huh. your mom. She'd be disappointed if I didn't. Right, fair. Don't worry. It was me! I was the turkey all along! Dun, well, dun, 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 uh. But, y'all, to be fair, to be fair, to be fair, to be fair, I have asked Parallax when Catless so many times. Uh-huh. 
No catless. Cat. He threw catless at me to shut me up. Okay. He did. Catless and missed. And it's okay. in the holler. <laughs> I need you. I Listen, need you to do something for that me. Depends, Wait, very very quick. that depends upon a variety of factors. <laughs> <There it is. laughs> For those of you watching at home, uh, Wookie has just asked us uh, how many gallons that hat would be, and um, that would that would depend. the uh, The Technodrome is a fictional construct, <laughs> so I'm going to link a picture in chat for you guys now. Of uh, I haven't the, seen oh, your printed catless. It's in the holler right now, sir. Good lord. Oh, I'm Gentlemen. responsible for that. Oh, <laughs> yes, you are. Oh. Um, Victron, thank you very much for the bits. Oh, however, I'm, yeah, I'm still waiting on White Rook to get caught up after his computer and everything died because um, he has promised me a um, tricorn so that I can make uh, pirate mechs and a flat cap for a um. Mm, uh, for a Masakari, and the uh, flat cap for the Masakari is actually for um, uh, Wordon. Nice. I'm because... going to interrupt here for a moment because okay. uh, Hype Train is going, and we have several people to thank. Yes, we do. Um, uh, we're not sure have... why, but we do have to thank them. Well, I've scrolled up a little bit. Oh, okay. So I'm, I'm just going to start going Quick. through and say unhinged, yeah, go ahead. unhinged thanking fire. All right, let's go as we oh. see wit underscore 17, the machine that goes bing. We've got the ninth clerk with free corn Thursday. Uh, this is we've the got... most expensive machine in the hospital. Sorry, go. Yes, the machine that goes bing. We've got Vectron uh, wants to know uh, if it's an Irby lamb with a top hat, which is close. That is spiritually the Technodrome with the weenie roast package. Oh, going on down the line, we've got some other stuff that came up and people were talking. And then we've got wit underscore 17 once again with some bits coming in just saying yes. <laughs> in response to what? I have no idea. I can't read that with my eyeballs. Oh, Grimo saying, you know what to do. And then, uh, Nermetia49 with yeet. Understandable, yeet. objectively, and morally correct, probably. <laughs> uh, Toilet Obliterator with my stripper name is All Beef Patty. That's actually a really good one. That's pretty good, yeah. That's, yeah, that's not bad. Uh, <laughs> Wait, underscore 17 is glorious. Night Owl for once, it's not my fault in any way. Oh, and then mm -hmm. with ducks. Can we go Dutch on uh, paying White Rook to make Catless? Hey, I made Catless. <laughs> the Night Owl. I hate it, but I made it. <laughs> Night Owl wondering if that's a 10,000 gallon hat. It uh, depends on a variety of factors. A variety of factors. <laughs> yeah, remember oh. when this only went up to level five? Oh, shit. Oh, God, hype train factor of seven. <laughs> <laughs> How did factor of seven independently become its own mimetic thing? I mean, I know the answer to that, but still. Hashtag because... text. Text edit. Yes. And then Moonstruck Man, hey, have fun out there. Thanks for coming by. Vectron says we ride at dawn. Moonstruck, we do. thank you very much. I don't know where we're going, but we're going at dawn. Uh, Waffle House. Waffle. I don't have a Waffle House near me. That, that, is, that is deeply troubling. I and, know. And I, you I, have to to drive, I have to drive to Houston to get to the nearest Waffle House. I have to drive to Albuquerque. Well, I mean, oh, okay. okay, that's actually really bad. Like, because then you're in Albuquerque. Um, I don't know. I'd rather be in Albuquerque than Houston. Uh uh, not right now. Oh, why is it? Is it uh, hot air balloon season? No, it's crime season. Oh, <laughs> it's okay. crime no. clock. It's really bad crime clock right now. Okay. Mm. Do they know that crime is illegal? They don't give a damn. We just got. Oh, that on. sounds very illegal. Mm -hmm. Um. 
Well, have they have the uh, local law enforcement tried giving out flyers saying that crime is illegal? Please don't do. <laughs> they don't. They don't prosecute the crime, so they don't give. They don't care. Oh, okay. you're getting now that, dangerously close to politics. That all right. yeah, I was going to say that sounds like conversation. Yeah, and that's all I'm going to say about that. Excellent, excellent. Moving along. Oh, I splattered purple onto my pink. I think. Are you sure? Tell. We're almost at I level six, boys. Oh God! Oh God! We're going to end up at a tell. hype train factor of seven just for the fucking meme of it, aren't we? Okay, so here's the thing. If Dig <laughs> shows up in chat, everyone type happy birth, like the words to happy birthday, and we will pretend that it was on purpose, that we summoned him with the bits. Yes! So that everyone yes. can Good. say happy birthday. Play it off. Act natural. All of this was in accordance to, as I, <clears throat> things are proceeding exactly as I have. Exactly been. as planned. Yeah, prophecy foretold. <laughs> you can't just go around foretelling things. That's why we have cowboy strippers named like Westside Roll Big Beef. Fizzle Beef. <laughs> Big McLarge Huge. I have predicted many things. <laughs> With your human senses. Some of them have come true. My meats are all a tingle, and that is why I am no longer an electrician. <laughs> <laughs> Grimos, uh, get on that. <laughs> 500 and some odd volts from a cat pan do, do, do kind of hurt. Oh, wait, yeah, that sounds not good. Don't do that. That's too much lightning for your meat. Uh, it was, That's it, it too was... much lightning for your meat, guys. Well, it turns out sometimes if there are uh, broken connections inside of a capacitor pan, which is why you have to take things apart to service, when you discharge said capacitors, um, the, the bank as a whole, uh, some of said large capacitors can still be holding voltage. Oh, good. Uh, that, as it turns out, is a thing. Uh, so, lesson was learned. No grab cap pan. Mm -mm. No, do okay. Understandable, but what if you take it out and shake it upside down like an etch a sketch so the electricity falls out? Oh, I, you know, it's funny, is that's what happened after I touched it. It went, it oh, it fell on up. you. I understand. Yes. It was very upside down upon removal of cap pen. Mm. And okay. many words were uttered. Okay, okay. I have yet another sound effect I've just added. Let's see if this uh, is actually loud enough for everybody to hear. Oh, Grimace, please don't quote that exactly like that in that context. That will not go well. I have no idea who that, that person was uh, or what they were talking about. Not at all my fault. Couldn't begin to guess. Who would say such a thing? Look, it was it was a clone, okay? It was, it was a clone? A clone. So okay. Since it's made the ports, well, you know, we could go with the easy answer. Fuck this boat! We did, um... <laughs> My identity has been compromised. <laughs> we did We did Galactic Death Star Repair for May the 4th. Uh, we, we released it end of last week. Yes, nice. we did. Um, th there may be something coming toward the end of the month. Oh. Oh, for... for uh, that's that's not up to me. That's... Day. The, for the good boys did not lose day? Yes. Um, if yes. you want to put it that way. That's the way I want to put it, and that's the way I'll put it every time. I have to re-record uh, the my part, the yeah. my part. Yeah, uh, the your part. Yes, because my part has has an error. It related to me being chronologically confused. Uh, Kicking a uh, mech in the dick is against Zelbringen. <laughs> um, right, but driving a tank over uh, into a mech. <laughs> Wait, is that just truck nuts writ large? <laughs> I think I got Cookie off guard. Oh my god. Now, is that like, is that the Solaris undercarriage package? Like, what is <laughs> the what's Solaris going on here? undercarriage package. Oh my. I'm... Now, listen. I'm I'm a traditional Lyran in this case. Many, many problems can be solved with ordnance while you eat in your cockpit. <laughs> um, oh my gosh. Is this all just a desperate attempt to bait me into saying that ordnance is stored in the balls? 
Wait, I've got one for this. I've got, I've got one for this. It is just no. got banana bone. <laughs> <laughs> Why do you have that on speed dial? <laughs> ah. oh. What, oh, what but... kind of world do we live in where things that we say actually like get listened to? Oh wow, that is scary. A really weird one. Uh, yeah, I... it's a very strange one indeed. Wait, Saints Row Cooney? I love that game. I. <laughs> yes, it's a good game. I um, I should never, under any circumstances, be considered like influential. If I say things, people should go. That is a dumb idea. We like that. Okay, goodbye. But here we are, and um, making making content with people, and turns out it is terribly good fun. No, no. <laughs> okay. Lord so Grimos were... is making his own film franchise, going from dying to dying harder. <laughs> Harder. I'm going to do something off. stupid because I want to know if it works. No one does. Um, like John McClane. Spoiler McClain. alert, it didn't work. <laughs> I don't remember oh. what it was, but it's okay. Grimo spilled boiling hot cocoa on his lap. Ow! Oh. Don't do this Grim is not... Uh, do oh, not oh, roast not those sure. specific beans. <laughs> that's not oh, where... God. That's oh. not where cocoa is stored. <laughs> that is not cocoa those are is stored in the beans. Do not roast those specific beans. That is not. That's advisable. not how boba tea works. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 I saw something the other day. I have no idea if it's true, but it I has... also saw many things the other day with my human ocular meat sensors. Continue. It, it, it had to do with the uh, the origins of the phrase boba, as far as tea goes, and mm -hmm. um, according to what I saw, and I seem to remember. I don't remember. Wherever boba tea comes from originally, and I'm, I know it's, I don't remember if it's like Southeast Asia or China or wherever it's from, and that, that, that's entirely on me. Um, apparently, the phrase boba, or the word boba, refers very specifically to something there, and... Um, it's 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 pretty funny for native speakers to hear Americans talk about these tapioca balls as being boba. It, because apparently it very specifically means a very top heavy woman. Boobies. Boobies. Yeah. yeah. So I can um say that I'm a girl. well endowed woman tea. I like it, so there you go. There you go. Welcome Cookie. to the party, Biz Monkey. What Cook. you've missed is the few fleeting moments of sanity that were allowed into this show in a desperate bid to trap others. It has succeeded beyond our wildest expectations, and the madness has expanded. You heard it here first, folks. Cookie likes well endowed woman tea. <laughs> Isn't it Albanian where the word car means, uh,. Gentlemen's region. Um, I don't know. I got to oh, get that's exactly, a rash. Exactly, exactly, oh, no. oh. <laughs> exactly. Um, <laughs> for those of you no. playing at home, um, <laughs> that's unfortunate. Come to the stream. Hmm. <laughs> uh, see my immediate random. I was going to say my immediate response to that was to ask Cookie to read it. Titties. Titties. Oh, oh also, dear. Also, um, also, there's a reason that the Nova didn't work so well in, uh, New in Mexico and Point South because Nova means does not go. Ah. The Chevy Nova. Yeah, Nova. I, I understand that, but if there was like the Ford broke ass car, I would definitely buy it. Uh, that was the Pinto, but they just didn't name it that. They named I, it Bean. I bought a specific <laughs> Chrysler product, and uh, I gotta tell you, it's uh, they they could should have just named it the uh, the Nova. Okay, no, I need to know now. You say specific Chrysler product. You do not specify vehicle. Did you purchase a hat? <laughs> Was it perhaps a keychain? Am I allowed? An to individual say that? floor mat. Am I allowed, considering I, it is my own personal experience and I have one and I have. I mean, it's not politics. Well, there you go. Uh, 
Go for it then. I'll go for it then. I, I Wait, bought an 07 did Jeep you? Liberty, brand new off the lot, and it went Ooh. back to the dealership 13 times. Half of those times, it was on a flatbed. The fact that that thing runs is just a testament to the fact that the engine in it is actually really good. Everything attached to the engine is not so much, but that's not quite the point. The dealership is uh, didn't really care, and uh, our local dealership is uh, garbage. And I Awesome. Have and yeah, so you know what? This is going to turn into random advice from a duck. Uh, chat, if you go and you purchase an automobile, you are going to date the sales staff. This is true. However, be, be very, very aware that you will be marrying the service department. Yep. You need to get to know the ones you're going to marry before you start uh, dating the, uh, the sales staff. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Do not ask the service department how the service department is. Do not ask the sales staff how the service department is. You go and you ask their victims how the service department is. Yeah. Yep. You, you are dating the sales staff. You are marrying the service department. Be very forewarned. Learn from my mistakes. It's, it's yep. very not. akin to the, to the uh, old saying of uh, when you marry your spouse, you're also marrying their family. Yep. Look at my, your look at your in law of the appropriate uh appropriate gender and go, is this you know, be aware that this might be twenty years down the road, you know, that kind of thing. In this case, my, my wife married into my family and you should feel slightly unfortunate for her. And Sinbirsky, you are a robot. Turn your nipples back off. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> <laughs> I am broken. Well, I mean, you're here, so we kind of <laughs> gathered that already. Titties. <laughs> Boba titties. <laughs> I have no idea if that story's true. I, I kind of hope it is. We're going to go with a very possible maybe. I, I hope it's true. Ensign Bierski, or... it, you've realized full well that the chainsaw nipples are for emergency use only, <laughs> not a day-to-day -day commute acceleration device. Well, not with that you know, attitude. I have said many times, and I have tried to catch traction with, with mechs with chainsaw feet, because that would make salvaging that much faster. But it never catches on. But I will continue to try. Listen, to listen to the chainsaw makes the traction difficult because it catches on everything. What if it's a Not what if it's so a snow chainsaw? Oh, that's why it was a schwang saw. Fair enough. Anyway, no. I, I understand just, now. I'm just saying, optional chainsaw feet double as roller skates in a pinch. But, uh, yeah, but with the schwang saw, you can deploy it and then just go at 3,000 miles an hour and nobody's going to report it because it's like, yeah, I just saw a robot going at 4,000 miles an hour on like a chainsaw penis and command is going to be like, no, you didn't. I'm not writing that down. And like, go pee in this cup, please. Uh... <laughs> and by that time, it's already reached its destination. Unfortunately, that destination was also command. Yeah, so it's a perfect loop of stealth. No, the urban mech no one saw coming. Literally. The urban stealth, mech urban no mech one saw just because they didn't want to. Vectron says go, go, gadget, penis. Oh. please Go, go, please, gadget, no, chainsaw, no, penis. No. <laughs> Double nope, nope, nope. This is, the, you know... <laughs> on here, control, con, uh, control Z, on here, uh-uh. <laughs> How do, I, how do I delete someone else's comment? <laughs> I am reminded... Moderation, moderation I am, replied. <laughs> required. I am reminded of an old SNL sketch with... Uh, I think it was Dan Aykroyd and... Um, Gilda Radner? I don't remember. Where they would uh, argue back and forth with each other about things. That, where the uh, Jane, you ignorant slut bit came from. Hello. Is that how that works? And uh, I, I just seem to remember at some point in that sketch, her response being, fuck me gently with a chainsaw. <laughs> what? 
I was gonna say I heard you talking something about my progeny, but then I came in on that line. <laughs> Fuck me gently with a chainsaw. Rather not. Oh, Rumble. you're a little loud, bro. <clears throat> Sorry. That's okay. He's eating his microphone. Uh, <laughs> Do not dip your gra microphone in gravy. I can't <laughs> use gravy. I use cheese sauce. Okay, oh. cheese sauce gums up the mic filter. This is microphone tech tips one. Jane Curtis. Jane Curtis. No cheese okay. sauce Curtis. in the microphone, sir. Yeah. Well, I it's never cool. took tech one hundred one. Well, okay, we then take the cheese out of your microphone. This is tech two hundred one. I, I don't know how. Okay, do you see the block of cheese? The block no. of cheese you're yelling into. I need you to ungrate that. Yes, right. ungrate. Oh, the cheese. do you? Ungrate cheese? Wouldn't that make me an ingrate? Sounds now like you're ungrateful. My... Okay, so I'm going to interrupt in my head. the shenanigans here for just a moment. Because the night clerk just linked this to me directly, so I'm oh, throwing no. it in the holler here so you all can enjoy this thing. Uh, so we can and all I share hate the it, pain. and it's glorious, and I hate it. <laughs> oh, night Lord. clerk, that's a fantastic use of computational resources. I hate it. I love it's it. Really this wow. is great. Wow. <laughs> wow. It's like the the twisted cousin of Howdy Doody. There he is. There he is, everybody. Now you can see him. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. Uh, oh god. Okay, you gotta zoom that in. Uh, that's that's a little bit of a problem. Uh <laughs> Let's uh, let's get rid of that real quick, and then I can open it in browser, and then there okay. we go. Oh, where where'd it go? Where'd it go? Oh my God, where did it go? Um, it has escaped okay. containment. It, oh oh God. God, that is now an everyone problem. Uh, it's, it's fucking gone. All right, I'm out. See y'all later. <laughs> it's good having you. Hi there. Ah, why does I'm it keep disappearing? <laughs> I'm scared of it. Hey guys. Um, I have, I have an actual funny challenge here. Is it finding the cursed monster before it <laughs> breaks its way out of the containment unit? No, it's funny I'm challenge. Little, I'm looking at the drops of paint that I have that I've been pulling from, and I don't know which one is black. I <laughs> funny funny <laughs> challenge involving that thing makes me think we're suddenly in Delta Green, and no one told us. Yeah, please set up a function on the stream where when, like, somebody does an action in chat that shows up for one frame. <laughs> <laughs> that That's just going to be our uh, our notifications just across the board from now on. Oh, God. <laughs> um, guys, um, okay, just because it's after 9 o'clock in the mountain time zone, I'm going to set up for a game of Us or Ain't. Us or Ain't. Okay. Time to play da, 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 game of Arrayed. Okay, how this America's works... favorite game show, according to people in America. <laughs> how this works is we, okay. We're going to include Warlax and Wookie in this, but it's going to be the usual folks. The if if uh, we're gonna, I'm gonna set a, uh, set up a prediction for two minutes, and you may bet your goob. Um, and the uh, the thing is, I will pull up a random quote, and the random quote will either be one of us, or it won't. It ain't. It ain't one of us. And if it's us, you get you vote for us, and you get the money. If not, ain't we'll get the money. Okay. Here we go. Uh, uh, goop, not real money. Goop. I gotta just gotta clarify that. Ready? Thank you, Night Clerk, for this bespoke that... nightmare. Go. I... I like it. I think it is. <laughs> I think that it is disturbing on multiple levels, and I like. It. Night Vectron. Night Vectron. Good night Vectron. Oh, all right. Uh, good night and but good luck. Again, I also play horror games and don't actually get it's scared. Somebody, I'm not somebody wants it correctly. to be us real bad. <laughs> okay, nope. Somebody's adding half as much on the same. Wow, well, we're keeping up. The the oh God, are it we is. still doing the? Okay, okay. Okay, for a minute you were saying that I was thinking, oh god, are we still in the hype train? No. <laughs> okay. No. Okay. But someone's I... keeping the betting line. We did not get to uh, uh, a hype factor seven, so we're okay. Not this I time. Have that just means a 
frankly unwise amount of wager of goob. Oh, I did that. I lost it. Oh, well. But uh, I have 2,000 goob. I'm, I'm getting in on this. Statistic. I know the statistics. And I don't care. And I don't care. I will do... Yes, I will continue backing finish. the bad bet. Yep. While others are out there printing money, I am <laughs> setting it on fire. Hit print money! Burr. Ow! <laughs> you know no. what would be really cool? I'm not even... I'm sorry, I'm not even close to my mic. Do you know what I think would be really cool? Yes. A waffle printer. Waffle printer. That's I'm just a sure waffle that's machine. A yeah, that that is a thing. Like it's it's in every hotel in America now. No, that is a waffle press. No, it's like flat, no. Oh, it's like okay, flat not, ironing. Okay, not it's every. It's like flat ironing your waffle. Okay, there are actually machines now in some hotels where uh, you press a button and it automatically makes waffle. Like not not a waffle press, not a waffle iron, but actually like. Oh. Waffle printer machine. You so reminded me of this. They've subscribed with Prime. They've subscribed for ten months. Oh God bless you. Well, thank much. you for joining thank us. Thank you. <laughs> well, I'm glad my <laughs> anniversary message is on a stream. Cookie broke herself with uh, <laughs> over taking. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. We we do things. We don't. Well, okay, I'm gonna go to eBay because I've been reminded of an appliance. Give me just a moment. That I... is it a Kicking a mech printer? in the dick is against cell bring it. It is. It is. I mean, it's not wrong. But, as if I'm piloting a tank, driving a tank, I am allowed to drive it straight into the uh, into their legs. And then oh, drive yes. it into their lower parts. Yes, I've got one for that, too. I'm going to do something stupid because I want to know if it works. Wait. Yes. Is it, is it, is it quote time? We don't know. Probably is, yes. Sorry. Give me a moment. I've lost track of those who speak All right. for us and those who speak against us. Uh, Here we go. Alright, 46 of you say it do be us. 54 of you say, no it ain't. Alright, ready? Set? Three, two, one, go! Quote number nine five seven. Oh, it's maybe it's we're the monster we made along the way. I don't a know. Significant amount of goo, but again, fish. Borderlands three. It's close. I, I was in that stream, but it wasn't me. Yeah, Warlax was in that stream. Like I said, it was close. Near miss. Not takes it. I have sixty goo. You missed my battleship. <laughs> well, no, I just. Don't out of us got 96 goob 96k goob parsed out master well, mayhem says nice. sweet sweet goob yes i just made 5000 goob welcome to goobulon 7 goobulon 7 the home of the goob if you promise not to sue us you can shove it Big up your nose your nose okay Poppers. but we would prefer you did Poppers. not for sanitary reasons Oofta. Oh, uh, he won. Uh, Wookie won over nine, over twenty k. Wow. Eighteen k. Grimless made nine k. Uh, Harp. Uh, oh. Kai Harper got up to twenty seven k. Samurai has a statement. Oh, what is what is Samurai's <laughs> statement? And I would make five thousand. God goob, bless it. And I would make five thousand oh, more. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, Samurai. Thank you very much. Uh, you know what? That Which one of these buttons lets me flip people off in chat? Uh, wait, wait, wait. I am I've, proud got of I've got that, you. I've got you. I've got you. That was no. an opening I haven't had in months. No, give me just a moment. Give me just a moment. I, I have... Uh... Fuck this boat. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I appreciate that. Hey, Squick, where you are working in location redacted, do they have boiled peanuts at the gas stations? <laughs> No, Hawaii does not have boiled peanuts at the gas station that I am aware of. What That's they do right. have at the gas station is, hear me out, gasoline available for sale from a robot. And I, I seem to remember it's roughly $11 billion a gallon. Uh, it compares favorably to West Coast prices. Favorably? 
Yeah. Oh, man. I bought it for under $3 a gallon today. Okay, you can go fuck yourself. Yeah. Like, you can afford it. Bring something here. I mean, to be fair, there are like, fair, oh, God, I said it. Fair. I fucking said it. To be fair. To be fair. Okay, you can go. <laughs> That's just Rick Rude of you. Uh, you need to come at it from a different Kurt Angle. I'm confused, but this whole thing's making <laughs> this whole thing's making people wince, McMahon. Yeah, Aha! I, I have found the thing I can send. What Lip Parallax lap. was gonna say because you interrupted him. I, I was going to say, uh, "Don't worry, I make up for it by living like within five miles of the carcinogen-ridden uh, refineries that make the gas." Yeah, <laughs> us too. Five whole so miles. So you can just like hook up your own tube. Oh, when I say refineries, I mean like seven of them. Yeah. Did you know, you know where I live. Nash has I live the stretch. stretch. Oh, I need a stretch. Something is going to pop and it is going to hurt. You might actually hear it on, on the, the microphone. I oh, my human spine. What the fuck was that? Oh. Samurai, Samurai said the wrestling puns really sting. I said they were a little bit Randy Savage. Oh, God. Also an excellent stripper man. Sad face. What was the sad face? Buster and he's he's forty five bits with a sad face. I don't know why. Um, ensign, uh, not Houston. <clears throat> Legally distinct Houston. Uh, 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 uh. Why is the sad face labeled Bible <laughs> thump? Because that's what it's because it's uh binding of Isaac. Oh, water break, water break, water break. Hail hydrate. Hydronium liquid water now available commercially for consumption by humans for humans. Ingest your dihydrous oxide right now. Would you like to know more? I desire to know more. Intense. I was dropping in for a moment just to say hi and see how progeny mech was going you all have a good well, night you don't Thanks. have to leave if you don't want to. you are welcome to stay with us because we like your madness also if you check the holler there. you will see miss blimey is basically Look, done here's the thing you guys like my madness para doesn't like when my madness takes full effect uh, yes see. but chat likes my pain yep that's that the thing. is why i am here yep <sighs> Oh, some, on, I have something for there this. There it is. There it is. There you go, Hal. Oh, that's wonderful. Thank you. It looks great. It looks. Kids of Car the Younger will be thrilled. I hope so. As for your pain. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, wait. Uh, what? Some, the fact what? Somebody once told me this was going to happen. <laughs> I hurt. Myself. Oh, no. <laughs> to see. Uh, I'd still feel. <laughs> oh, Christ. I focus <laughs> on the pain. Oh, why? The is this only the soundtrack that's real. This is the soundtrack of hell. Yeah, this this goes very well with the car boning. <laughs> I had to get I had to get to the fourth line boat. so that I could get the R. It was a boat. It was a boat. I'm on a boat. Also it was Diggs not... just got banana bone. Um <clears throat> So one of my kids called one of my other kids a uh, psychopath today. Oh fine. And, well, okay yeah, then. Yeah. Was it was you uh, wrong? Um I don't know for sure. Jerry's still up. Don't know for sure. That's probably what parents not. want to hear about their kids. Probably, probably not. But, oh, good. But, yeah, just, it's been a week. Let's just put it that way. I am now painting the Cowboy Technodrome. Excellent. Miami is complete. Samurai has... If I can get <laughs> this sticky tech to stick to the fox bite. Oh, no. the Technoboy Dingy. Cowdrome. Wookie, Wookie. <clears throat> I would do anything for love. But, uh, uh, now there's that. two of you. <laughs> See, Samurai threw an idea this way. And what will happen is whenever Ducks gets gets to a place he's happy with his cowboy technodrome, 
he will uh, share a picture. And he will say, Look at this photograph! Oh, Christ! Every oh, time I do, it Did makes me know? laugh! <laughs> <laughs> What was the name of that uh, musician? What was the name of that musician? Like, God, it must be 15 years ago, where their entire thing was just taking requests off the internet. Oh, um, and I don't know. You just but they, they, they had a song called. Me. No, no, no. It, it, they had a song called "Intimidated by the Size of My Burrito." Nope, don't know this one. And somehow that stuck in my head. So. I don't know which one of those, or which one of you to blame casting for that. Casting couch? But... Was it casting couch? I think, wants that, I think that was a different thing. If I could pick was any one... Was that not the pornographist <laughs> establishment? <laughs> <laughs> it, I think... Skirting um, around that. Songs to wear pants to? Yes! That is the one! Wow! Para. Is that a long bow? That is a long bow. That is a long bow. What color does it need to be for if, older kids a car? If you ask kids a car the eldest, kids a car the eldest wants every mishmash of colors you can put oh, on. Oh, good. I'll let uh, my, Lisa Frank? my I'll let my daughter paint it. Yeah. Yes, samurai Celtic techno burrito. Celtic techno. Yes. Oh, I'm sorry. Burrito. I love yes. Chase because Kids Akar, the oldest, asked me to start a Mech Warrior 5 playthrough that was Team Kids Akar, the eldest. Okay. And the, the paint scheme that Kids Akar, the eldest, picked was, you know, the Free Worlds League scheme that's in Mech Warrior 5? Yes. On that's... black instead of white. Okay, so that's that's the. I think that's technically the Free World Legionnaires. Uh, it's it's the the purple and green, yep. but every time you see art of it, there's never purple on it. It's just green, but all the references clearly say purple and green. Oh no! Uh, oh, Beersky says make it look like Helen Keller painted it. Oh, mm. you know what Helen Keller would say if she was here? Mm. No. Uh. <laughs> oh, somebody's mad about that. <laughs> Um, That's not true. She learned it all right. as she got older. Yes, um, yes. Well, let's keep it classy here. Yeah, yes. Sorry, making I mean, a joke well, about a movie. Um, we are so, well past the point of keeping it classy. <laughs> yeah. Um. So what? I was gonna say something semi-important. Right <laughs> I tried that once. Not didn't stay work. In the world. All right. Okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. While you but... wait, while you wait to remember. If I could pick any one person on the interwebs to record stuff with, it would be the epic movie trailer voice guy. Oh, that dude's... Yeah. Balls. That guy's hilarious. Like... Like, I'm, I, I'm humorous. That guy's hilarious. <laughs> Dude, circle I to stay have on moments the calendar. Of bone. He, listen, circle to stay on the calendar. Mad Ducks both agreed that he's funny and accepted responsibility for something. I did not One say thing. that I am funny. Oh. I said I am humorous. Uh, Do you like believe Haley? that's a synonym? Close enough. But... It is a leg bone. Like, the stuff that I've got, like, from Haley on right now has got me giggling so bad. I can't like, wait it's... till we can do our one. That's yes. gonna be fun, too. I'm we so need... looking forward to commercials. We need time to be able to sit I think that's the first and... time anyone has Before. ever said that. Looking <laughs> well, we uh, we have gonna do our have, things, yeah. We, we have we time. Maze Hughes time. says belligerent and humorous. Uh, yes, oh. if you do insanity with your pinky out, it does make it classy. Okay. At that point, it means that you're not uh, insane, it means you're eccentric. Um, but uh, well, apparently, well, apparently, the pinky thing out was not. As yeah, anyway, there's an interesting history to that. Is it kind of like the white after Labor Day thing where it was the old rich weeding out the new rich? No, oh, okay, no. Oh, I get the impression it's much, much worse. 
I'll have to look it up again to make sure I'm right. But it, yeah, yeah, something like that. Oh, oh, Tio has. Yeah, okay. something like that. Yeah. I dropped my cowboy disco ball and it fell no! in the paint. <laughs> so. Um, on the one hand, that's terribly unfortunate. On the other hand, this is your opportunity to add metal damage. There you go. Tank wait, battle damage. Wait, hang on. Well, I would. You know what? I was about to ask a super insensitive question. Okay. Yeah, can't do that. Not gonna do it. Not. All right. Not gonna do it. Damn it. Wouldn't be prudent. I, uh, I tried to stop myself. Wouldn't be prudent. You, you just jumper. picked up the ball and ran with it. Yep. So Dr. Chef the other day while on stream shared the story of why when I was uh, pulled over and uh, had to show the uh, state trooper my sausage. But yes, I remember this story. Uh, I'm not giving context. What? Okay, uh, Grimos says the bedlam in this channel has been wish witnessed by my father's ear holes. He blinked and went, alrighty, and then has since gone off without one of the dogs to go to sleep. Bless his soul. Well, <laughs> sounds rough. <laughs> oh, God. <clears throat> I see what you Lord, did there. I asked you to stay, to and you're doing this to me. Ah. Uh, that was a can leg you, up. Can you sneak over to pet the dog? Um, Parallax, don't yes. worry. You're his brother. You already know that his bark is worse than his bite. Like a tree. Yeah, but the only problem is the only problem is that he's, he's gonna dog it with these puns. He's a dogwood yeah. tree. It's a this joke brought to you by uh, King's Quest Six. King's Quest Six air today, gone tomorrow. Grumble. Yeah. No, no, I approve. I don't care if you approve. I'm bitching. I I have to Fair say, Tara, I appreciate. That uh, that was a really one good one to go after. That that'd be a uh, golden retrieval. <laughs> that was a, that was a laffy taffy pun, sir. And <laughs> it was funny, but it was a stretch. Oh, okay. Oh, that okay. was from the estate, Mister Armstrong. All right, Nash oh. says that Para has a bone to pick. You can select a variety of bones at your local butchery. <laughs> I mean, they're all going to be roughly the same variety, but... Uh, oh, your no, average butcher, yeah. Your average butcher, in order to save costs, they, uh, they typically buy sides or quarters uh, as needed. Joker. Joker made the point to say that his dad spilled shout on the dog and now he can't find spot. Uh, uh, yes, yes. That is uh, the pits. Contrast of parallax in my oh, reaction is this glorious. Uh, yes. So you want to know more something funny puns. From, so you want to know something funny about like um about uh uh Greek mythology? No, no, yeah. no, I don't. No. Yes. Uh, yes. You know what Kerberos is in, in Greek? Yes, I do. Spot. Yep. That is you a don't. possible translation. Yep. <sighs> so the the Hound of Hell is named Spot. That's one of those things you got to meet head on, head on, head on. <laughs> Apply directly to the Shit forehead. Get <laughs> on a shingle. Oh. My grumbling will not be contained to this format. That was a mastiff groan from the audience. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. More, more dead puns. That was Bring beautiful. On. Beautiful. Bring oh, that was made uh, Tomasa, what, what does it look like I have? <laughs> because uh, my, my texture pad here is actually just a piece of Bristol board that I have... Uh, I have many, many times now uh, primed over the the uh, paint that's on it. Wookie wants to know if we're kibbling about this. That was also oh. a laughy taffy, dear. Sorry. Oh. Yes. Oh. Yes. I've oh. you three grumble points. No. Oh. 
I'm just I'm just satisfied. This is great. I'm, you I'm seem like you're this. drawing power from this. <laughs> uh, yes, um, so I. It's, it's bad enough that Parallax is thinking of catching a greyhound out of town. Um. So, uh, Tark checks. Yeah. Tark K- X T is says no, uh, he's going to invest in headphones because no one around him deserves this pain. <laughs> So, you could invest in headphones, or you could invest in larger speakers. <laughs> yeah, making it an everyone problem. Wait, does Truth? my does my dry my dry palette looks like I have a skull floating in a bowl? I'm willing to accept that. Yeah, uh, true story. Uh, one of my friends in high school came over and said <laughs> to my mom, and he said to my mom, "My mom, uh, my mom's car is in the shop." Because she mm. hit a greyhound going 75 miles an hour. <sighs> My mom, without missing a breath, says, damn, that's a fast dog. Yep. Um, <laughs> so, uh, so UNC says... Uh, I saw uh, what he said. Mute, I saw mute, what he said. <laughs> Beautiful. It's absolutely the Malamute <laughs> button. Yeah. Oh. Right, hold on. This gets a golf clap right here. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> Thank you, Samurai. So I'm got not 24 this minutes behavior. of this shit. So, <laughs> that um, that that uh, dog that was going so fast sounds like it's not natural. It sounds like it was made in a lab. Uh, although my mom's next line was, "How fast was your mom going?" <laughs> um. Fuck hi, Stuka. Boat. Look at Stuka of the Black Panther Legion. Hi, Stuka. Stuka. Stuka, help. <laughs> Stuka, more puns. No, no. Oh, Krillis, please don't make us barking mad. He says you're going to make us barking mad. Oh, damn it. Oh, <laughs> the fuck people. Uh, yes, I knew I could count on Stuka. Thank you. Uh, you see, uh, Parallax is groaning, and I am just enjoying the moment. My pain. I, the, your pain does not does not in, in bother me at all. I am uh, just enjoying no this kill, moment. Uh, I am enjoying uh, this moment. We are, this is are we supposed great. to hit pause? My, these puns are off the leash, but it's getting late. But and I need to duck soon. It says uh, race. Damn and, it! And and we are just uh, under uh, the barriers with these puns. Uh, <laughs> where where is my button that just plays fifty seven uh, tracks of the Vuvuzela, so I cannot hear any other intruding <laughs> audio? It's, it's Why good. do I not have that? Uh, Very similar. Thank you. That sounds, that, that sounds like the kind of thing you would talk about, what that sounds like. Stuka, thank you for your help at the meetup. I will open a beer and hand it to you as thanks. Which I'd have done anyway, but... Indeed. Pet? I got to pet earlier, so I have a pre, pre, uh, pre-stored up pet because daughter brought the kitty by to get pets. Where is my um, cat? My, my cats do not inhabit the office with me while I do this. Not Our that Nash. they ever actually come in here to start with. So Nash makes the point that someone needs to shepherd this crowd. That's usually my job, but today I, I, um, I could say something. Uh, well, that would be a little bridge too far, so I won't. <clears throat> I kept waiting for you to say something like you're off the leash, or no, it was going to be more bridges. No, so I was gonna, yeah, I was gonna make a really bad, like bad pun but it wasn't quite all thought out so it was gonna it was gonna be really really bad so the truth is that tonight the stream is off the chain Mm. i hate everything and everyone what yeah (laughs) that's normal i was trying to unplug my microphone physically from here who was I don't know, bro. Yeah, it might have been me. Got it, so I don't know what kind of internet wizardry Squick's trying to do. I am several wizards in one trench coat. Can any of them make uh, your equipment show up on time? I pet the cat again. No, that is illegal magic. <laughs> ah, samurai, thank you. Uh... Down, he needs to grab a Sharpay. 
Uh, well, on the no, upside, not allowed. On the upside, Squick shared pictures of showed us pictures of a nice rack. That's oh. he did. He Technically did. true. <laughs> It was yeah, a... after we talked about the tea, let's not... Okay, whatever. It was Boba. Boba these racks? Yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> yes, there we go. There's my... There's my... Uh, uh, no, I'm not happy about it. My response to split hand eggplant. There you go. There it is. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes. So, from the internet... From the the GPU is a tiny and simple-minded wizard who can cast one spell very fast. Linear algebra. <laughs> this is true. Wow. It's an impressive spell. It, it is not an impressive spell unless you can do it several million times per second, in which case, good job. Hey, uh, it, Squig, it do you have any questions you'd like to ask ChatGPT tonight? Oh, let me see if I still have that tab open. <laughs> how many gallons is the... How big is the hat that would fit on top of the technodrome? <laughs> Hello, chat GPT. <laughs> I am attempting the to test no value. <laughs> fictional value of a hypothetical hat placed atop the technodrome if it were filled entirely with standard value baked beans <laughs> as priced on oh, good. the open market assuming pricing is consistent with bean value <laughs> In late 2017. While it generates, got to do a quick couple quick things. Night Owl's gifting out there. Thank you, Night Owl. And then Joker wanted to know the base coat for the longbow. The base coat for the, like, what have I got on it or what am I going to do with it? He just said, what was the base coat for that longbow? Oh, the base coat what? was uh, black and I dry brush gray over it. That's it. Okay. So far, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to hit it with a heavy black wash uh, with some uh, flow improver mixed into it so it doesn't stay on the uh, flat surfaces. And that should give me a pretty good simulation of black. Okay. Enjoy your mistake that Owl made for you. All right. Enjoy squick. the mistake that's not your fault. Has it generated your answer yet? Oh, I'm giving it additional criteria. One well, moment. It's very important because otherwise it's going to tell him it depends on a number of factors. <laughs> Given that the technodrome is fictional. That's right. <laughs> oh, yeah. The, we, we, I promised that if you recorded that, I would put it on my uh, my YouTube page and share I have it, it with here. the world. I will share it. No, not, not yet. Not yet. I will Not share yet. it with the world when it is ready. When it oh oh, is there music behind it? Are there, there effects? I don't know yet. When I get the file, okay. I will see what the spirit moves. Oh, okay, spirit. it's it's typing an answer. Oh good. <laughs> oh my, this this is quite long. Oh dear. <laughs> All right, Squick, let them have it. I think it's still <laughs> going. It, it is still going. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll, I'll start reading while it does that. We'll get to the end together and it'll be an adventure. Hello there. As an AI language model, I'd be happy to provide you with an assessment Ooh. of a hypothetical hat atop the technodrome filled with standard value baked beans. First, let's consider the value of the baked <laughs> beans themselves. Assuming that the market value of standard value baked beans in late 2017 was consistent, we can estimate that the current value of a can of baked beans and extrapolate that to determine the total value of the beans within the hat. According to the data from the Bureau of Labor Statistics, the average cost of a can of baked beans in late 2017 was around 83 cents. If we assume that the hat on top of the technodrome... Bean costs? Uh, apparently. Oh, God, I'm glad I don't have... Like, that's my job, but at an even more hellish level. 
If we assume that the hat on top of the Technodrome is a large hat, capable of holding 1,000 cans of beans, then the total value of the beans within the hat would be around $830. Now, let's consider the Technodrome itself. As a fictional <laughs> vehicle, the Technodrome has no real world value, there but we can assess its potential value within the context of the story. The Technodrome oh. is a large, menacing vehicle that serves as the base of operations for the villainous Shredder in the Teenage Min Mutant Ninja Turtles franchise. As such, it could be argued that the Technodrome has significant fictional value as fictional. a key element of the story. Finally, let's consider the hat itself. If we assume Let's that the hat is a large, hat. sturdy hat capable of supporting the weight of 1,000 cans of beans, then it too could have some value. A quick oh, search of online retailers shows that large hats can range in price from a few dollars to hundreds of dollars depending on the quality of the hat and the materials used. Based on all of these factors, I would estimate the potential value of the the hat the Technodrome filled with standard value baked beans to be in the range of several hundred to perhaps a few thousand dollars, depending on the size and quality of the hat and the perceived value of the Technodrome within the story. However, it's However. worth noting that the actual value of this hypothetical item is ultimately up to individual interpretation and may vary wildly depending on factors such as personal preference, market demand, and cultural significance. Cultural significance <laughs> of the hat on the Technodrome. Filled with I'm... baked beans, comma, standard value. <laughs> I'm completely okay with this answer. Like, okay, so th okay. This is... Squick, as, yeah. far as, as far as the quality of the hat goes, it's crushable and it's wool. Let's assume the hat in question crushable and wool. The um, Technodrome is why Tom's daily driver. Yeah, well, uh, no, I'm not sure about that because as we have all been led to understand, um, Tom Tom Bedill of the Black Pants Legion does not associate with any vehicle that does not, and I quote, haul ass. <laughs> to be perfectly frank, I mean, it, it is an interdimensional fortress, so. It can haul much. <laughs> how many? Uh, uh, Squick, how many asses can the Technodrome haul? I will ask in a moment. <laughs> uh, I have provided Bonus an additional... Points. Bonus points if it actually gives you measurements in donkeys. Yep, yep. Yep, that's, that's what I'm anticipating. Okay, so we're going to put Longbow aside for the moment. Oh, what else do I have? Where did... Okay, we did you, Eris. Um, who wants to see an alpha wolf? I have an alpha wolf. Painting uh, this cowboy technodrome is going to be a multi-night uh, adventure. <laughs> with, the, with the safety value of seven, guys. Safety factor of seven, yep. This has a safety factor of seven. Does the technodrome? No. Yes. Okay, it good. Does. It's the head, it is. isn't it? Uh, yes. No, this is going to take, uh, this is going to be a multiple, uh, multiple installment adventure. The Cowboy Technodrome. Because I have to do, uh, successive layers of lighter gray and then dry brush on white. And Why Pinto? Why not? Paint. Okay. Sorry, I'm... Hmm? Oh, go, go ahead. ahead. No? Uh, no. I'll... Okay. Uh, I'm just gonna cherry pick one excerpt from this. Oh, good. Additionally, the concept of a safety factor of seven is not a standard measure of a vehicle's <laughs> capacity or safety. It is unclear how this factor would apply to the Technodrome or any other vehicle. Thank you. Ask it what a safety factor of seven means with regards to a, an aeroplane. No, to, to a uh, 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 Christmas bullet. No, no, just just leave it aeroplane. Aero, a e r o plane. Yes. <laughs> but Doctor Christmas said so. He did. Doctor Christmas said a lot of things. Doctor Christmas said many things, many, <laughs> perhaps even human things. He said many things without even having to stop to think and use words. Well, he certainly <laughs> didn't fucking oh, do God. that. The robots made 
He didn't and think I hate nipple, it. but he used words. I'm sorry, the robot's doing what, Squick? It, Squ it's contextualizing the answer to a point that it makes sense. <laughs> Do you want three paragraphs that will ruin the joke? No, no, I don't. <laughs> okay. I'm... Save I'm it for afraid. later. We got like ten more minutes. I don't want to kill the joke now. <laughs> uh, so it's still estimating uh, five hundred to eight hundred dollars for the bean hat. For a crushable wool bean hat, large enough to fit on the Technodrome, full of beans, five <laughs> to eight hundred dollars. Man, that's a good value. That's a great fucking. I feel value. like that's the price. To get someone to carry it away. Like, I will give you $800 to take this hat full of beans and make it not my fucking problem. You're not wrong. <laughs> like, what are you going to do? I'm going to dump it in the sewers. You've made an enemy for life. Not our problem. <laughs> You've made an enemy for life. Not me, mind you. Just some enemy. Uh-oh. Oh, God, what? Yeah. Oh, so, no. Oh bean no! Hat. What have you done, Samurai? Bean hat. Bean hat. Why what? does this say last yes. purchase? Wait. <laughs> also, I want to take a moment here. Um, Joker. Um, I'm very concerned about the fact that you were insinuating that more than one of these hats sold. They bought different. I mean, hats to match different outfits. Come on, man. Oh, they've got different hats for the Technodrome. Yeah, they change the treads every oh, day. Oh god. Oh, I hate it so much, Samurai. I hate it so much. I oh. love it. Thank you, Samurai. Oh. This has been the best link oh. I've had in the last last little while. Oh it's my soul. Oh god, I'm gonna send that to Squick. I mean. Oh. Again, I clicked on that link and it said last purchase. In I'm, 2022. I'm very, I've got to tell you, Parallax may hat. not be having a good night, but I'm enjoying the madness. I'm I wear so a fucking much. hat every day because otherwise I get heat sick at this time of year. Well, I mean, you could get one with beans on it. <laughs> Yeah, but then my students would be like, Miss yeah. Cookie, Miss Cookie, why do you have beans on your hat? You know, um, Wookie, I know you're in chat. Mother's Day's coming up. Don't you dare buy me a bean hat. <laughs> <laughs> I really hope uh I really hope uh Kitty or Ducky are in the uh chat. <laughs> um but yes, uh well Mother's Day our anniversary and my birthday all fall. Oh, that sounds week. like the perfect opportunity to get a bean hat. No, bean I don't want yeah. a bean hat for my holidays. No. You don't want a bean hat unless you get the matching bean shirt. Oh, God. Thank you, Biz Monkey. You know, you know, Cookie, it could be your summer hat. It could be, but yeah. I have a it hat. It could be your winter hat. It oh, and be bean, I bean have leggings. It, it could be your perpetual hat. Now, I have to be, I have to be honest. I wore, I, I unironically wore a Viking hat to work uh, several times just because I wanted to. And okay. it was there. Um, I would wear that bean hat. And if someone asked about the bean hat, I would literally only respond with the word beans. It, beans. If, if, honestly, if I was wearing that hat and somebody asked me why I was wearing that hat, my response would be, I like beans, Gary. It's just, just <laughs> no, it's just the word beans. Just by the beans. way, I found I found a Hank Hill for your Boomhauer. By the way, I just don't oh. remember who. It was. Yes, I don't remember. Oh no, it was um. Boomhauer. Oh, that code? It was. It was uh, Gosh darn it! It was uh AJ a, 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 AK. Oh well, there we go. We need AK and I yeah, to next time. Next time we do the thing, we're gonna we're gonna sit over by him and and. Oh, there we uh, go. So gosh dang it, Bobby. Yeah. Dang it, paralyzed. Uh, man, I'll tell you what, man. Get on up on that thing, Bobby and that old uh, Savage Wolf, man. He'd just shoot them LRMs off in the sky, man. Beep, 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 beep. Man, like your spheroids, do. man. They just uh, spattered all over the ground, man. They don't even know what happened to them now, you know, Praise Kransky. I published, I published that. 
I shared this with the world. And then it went on I pop, 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 pop. And dang, when a man popped out of that car, man, and just like an on popcorn lung or something. So I was playing the um, Text Talks history at work. Uh-huh. Through the sound system. Like, like through the on sound a, system. Okay. On a screen. And I was asked, what is that? And I said, this is what this is. Can you send me a link to this? I paused it. I sent the link. I resumed it. That happened. That's wow. awesome. I think, and nice. I think it's funny. It's awesome is what Lord. it is. I, I showed that one to my wife, and she she's watched several of the other uh, Text Talks videos with me to placate me. And, like, I know it's to placate me. There's no qualms about that. She watched this one, and she said, I loved that. <laughs> so Tex has found... Unlocked a new audience with history. <laughs> Achievement get. Nice. Achievement get. Get the co well. I can't even say get the college crowd on board because he's already done that with other professors talking to him about the Hobbesian Leviathan and BattleTech. Oh man! So so here's what we've accomplished tonight. Uh, where did I put that? Confound Here's what we've accomplished stalker. tonight. Number one, I caused problems. <laughs> number, number two, two <laughs> number two, uh, how does a car cause problems? I cause Don't problems. be yeah. part of the problem. Be the whole problem. <laughs> you know, I can share. I may. Uh oh. Okay, so um, there we go. There's uh, there's uh, kids a car number two stalker. It's it's green. I may do some more work on it later, but it's black and green. I hope he loves it. And I, uh, will. I will continue working on the longbow here for him. Uh, I may put another black wash on it after this dries just to darken it up some more. But, uh, wow. This has been an evening. That Did I share Miss Blimey with... Miss Blimey? I'm not sure you did. I know it's in the holler. Oh. I, don't know if I, I think my favorite part about this stream is that you know, I'm having a great time over here, and then I forget there's actual art and skill on display, so we get to the <laughs> end, and it's just a special treat. Uh, <laughs> you just get to the end, and the whole evening, you've just been going, Fuck this boat! And you get here, and it's Diggs just <laughs> got banana bowed. <laughs> so, I mean, I wouldn't call what I do art necessarily, but it is it is legally painting. I, I don't know that I'd call what I do art, but it, yes, is, yes, it is certainly yes, artisan. Shut oh, up. Both of you shut up. Hey, Parallax has actual skill. You guys have... you guys paint well. I slap paint on objects and hope it turns out okay. How, I actually I know where I'm going to go with this damn heiress yet. I can't even see most of the stuff that I am painting uh, if, if there is any color on it that I can't see, which is kind of frequently anytime there is red or green or apparently purple. Seraph, you might be one letter off in that statement. Yeah, the R is just, just the wrong one. Rotate it a little bit. Stop. Don't be mean to my friends. I'm not being mean. I'm I trying mean, to make a joke. I'm I mean, talking, I'm talking to them. They're being mean to my friends, Mad Duck and Parallax. Sometimes uh, okay. I'm mean to your friend. How's the car? Parallax, well, I'll be mean to you. Different. You be mean that, to me. Okay, okay. Ducks, that's you're colorblind, and that's rivalry. funny. Parallax, you groan a lot, and that is the source of why people make you groan more. Yep. You don't have to be right so fucking loud. <laughs> okay. uh, it's more for the people. He's not a line, but he's right. <laughs> that is but one of the services on offer at this establishment. Oh God! So, it is. It is ten fifty nine. There are still fifty seven of you here, and I don't know why. Why are you here? Yeah, that's kind of what I'm getting at. Oh Lord! I guess next week we'll work on something. I don't know what yet. What? what? Oh, hi, hi, Doctor Who. Next week will be um. Next week will be the uh day of after my birthday. Hey, hey, yeah. Cookie, what did Joker say there? What? Ooh, ooh, woo! Thank you. Uh, Doc, Doctor Who says we like the cringe. 
Uh, <laughs> he's not wrong. Somebody oh, wants to me. Fucking hell. No one has told you that. <laughs> <laughs> it's now the top of the hour, and you've wasted two perfectly good hours with us. Since, Give me since just a moment. Give me just a moment. We may not be. Qu I, I need to check for one thing. Keep talking. He's okay, then I'll continue making mouth sounds in the auditory oh, human range in order good. to fill the airtime. It shall be as unlimited as a three-for-one deluxe sale on rotisserie chicken from the Goodyear blimp in the year 1877 as it flew through a time travel wormhole on the second space moon. That was, of course, before the moon was exiled as the Pluto, as we all moon. know and remember, yeah, like, to make room for the Disney yellow dog. The, uh, the dog, of course, was first made famous in the 1839 picture To the Moon with Pluto, the self-referential piece wherein the name was first stolen, much like fire from the gods, resulting in a much harsher punishment in that we were relegated to a world where Disney owns Star Wars whole cloth and is free to do with that as it will. The money printer being what it is in this day and age, we can only feed it paper so fast. That's why a number of institutions have been developed in order to develop the paperwork faster. Now, the faster the paper moves, the more economy exists in one place at one time, which is why we're currently looking at our space exploration and exploitation options, because nothing says good for the economy quite like dragging in a couple of dozen asteroids of the finest platinum commercially available. That's right, five nines of purity mined in okay, space and okay, by space. Okay, I can't find the, the clip I wanted of just Cookie saying ooh ooh, so I'm going to let it go. <laughs> Thank you. Like, I'm going to find that, and then that's going to be a button on my thing. Thank you. Thank you. So, thank you uh, very much, folks, for the early birthmas, which oh. is... Uh, uh, Doc, it, there is a trick to to doing this, and it is mouth open, brain off. Yeah, uh, when you, definitely that. When you have to <laughs> test microphones at work all the time, it, there you have to ramble into the microphone while said microphone is being calibrated, set up, and it is, yes... Flush the buffer and give it three barrels of yeehaw. Yeah, exactly that. Yeah. I don't know what it means, but do that. Why couldn't Luke Skywalker find love? Why? Oh, no. He was. Oh, 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 I know it. He was looking for love in Alderaan places. Thank you, Samurai. Hey, hey, with hey you, Mad Ducks. Hey, yes. Mad Ducks. What's in an Ewok's ears? What? Ewax. There you go. Hey, How did the what? Ewok cross the road? How? He walked. He walked. Hey, Para. What? <clears throat> did you know that there was a guest star in Return of the Jedi that most folks don't know about? Oh no. Fozzie Bear played an Ewaka Waka. Damn it all. What's Damn he it in all. That's not even. Tatooine, lukewarm. I hate everything. I hate this. Uh. <laughs> it's good to know we're going out on a down note. Uh, yeah, yeah. I'm, you're not wrong. Do uh, I link Galactic Death Star Repair if people want? Um, I don't know. No. Yes. Uh, okay. I don't want to. I don't want to self plug. Yes, um, you do. Do it. But, but, I demand um, it now. Now you have to. Um, no, listen, listen. No, the um. Must I? Um, what color was Alderaan? Oh, I don't want to know. Blue. Because it blew up. Behold a link to Galactic Death Star Repair. Okay, I am violence. Pay your bills. Get folks. Free Corn Friday. Wear you some gloves. We're out. <laughs> Good night, everybody. Good night, everybody. Well, it is not the night unless it is the artisanal darkness selectively created through the use of stellar fusion energy by means of a mass stellarator. I'm going to cut you off now. <laughs> In a number of retail sectors throughout.